Hi everyone, it's Tiffany and Nova with Easy Toddler Hairstyles and we're back with another hairstyle today. Um, this one will take you 10 to 15 minutes and it was inspired by Pretty Girl 79. Um, I will link her down in my description box below if you want to check her out on Instagram or YouTube. Um, also, we are having a baby in August. We're having another baby girl and so we may be scarce for a few weeks. I'm going to try to have enough content to um, ready to go, but just in case you don't see us for a few weeks, that is why. Um, and we are so excited to have another little girl in our family. Are you excited to have a sister? Yeah. Yes, she has three brothers, so she's pretty excited to have a sister, right? All right, let's go ahead and get started. are sectioning off this hairstyle. I'm spraying her hair down with a little bit of water to make it more manageable and then I'm going to make a part down the center from her forehead to the back of the crown. I'm going to then part from left to right and right to left. This front section is going to be comprised of eight ponytails. The back section I'm simply going to um, put out of the way for now. So with this front section we are going to do four ponytails on each side. I'll split the section in half just so that they stay more even and then split the section in half again. I'm going to start with the ponytails closest to the center part line and I'm just securing it at the back by the crown, so at the back of the section. So here is our second ponytail. Um, I'm using water and spray gel and making sure to comb out each section as I go. Um, when you work with wet or damp hair, um, it allows for less flyaways to be incorporated into your ponytails and makes an overall cleaner, neater style. And that's why you see me working with damp hair all the time. Um, it just creates a nicer, cleaner style. So here is our fourth ponytail on the left. And then we are just going to repeat what we did on the left on the right. So I'm splitting the entire section in half and then splitting it in half again. Now to get nice, um, clean, clear parts, um, you just have to make one confident swipe. Sometimes I have to go back and part it out more than once if I'm not happy with how it looks. But lots of practice and you'll get better at parting um, styles like this out. So I have four ponytails on each side, eight total. And now with the remaining hair, I'm going to pull it out of my placeholder. And I'm simply going to split the rest of this hair in half down the back and create two flow pigtails. Again, I'm just using water and spray gel, combing it out. And then I'm going to secure it at the nape of the neck with an elastic. So I do this on the right side and I'm just going to repeat it on the left side. And I will link our favorite products in the description box below in case you're interested in our spray gel that we love and use in every single style. All right, coming back to the front section now, I'm going to take the left ponytail closest to the middle part line, split it in three, and I'm going to start a three strand braid. So when I bring one side over, that's considered a stitch. You're gonna come down like five or six stitches on each side until you're even with the second ponytail on the right. Then when you cross that hair over, you're going to bring that second ponytail in and then cross the other side over, cross the left side over again, cross the right, and then the left, and then add another ponytail in. So right, left, right, left, add the ponytail. So every fourth stitch you should be adding a ponytail. And we'll repeat this again on the other side so that you can see again how it's done. So once I run out of ponytails to add, I'm just going to continue to do my three strand braid. And I'm going to wrap it around and bring it to the opposite pigtail. So this is my left braid and I'm going to bring it to the right pigtail in the back. We're gonna repeat this on the other side. So your right ponytail is gonna cross over the left. I'm going to create three parts. And then I'm just going to braid down until I'm even with that second ponytail on the left. 
So once I'm about even with that second ponytail, I'm going to cross the strand over, add the ponytail, and then four stitches. One, two, three, fourth stitch, add another ponytail. Then one, two, three, fourth stitch, add another ponytail. And then again, we're gonna do the same thing. I'm going to just continue a three strand braid, cross it over the other braid that I already have, and then add it to the left hand ponytail. Here's one final look at the style. Like I said, it should take you about 10 to 15 minutes to complete. As always, thank you so much for watching. Um, you can give this video a big thumbs up below and leave us a comment if you want to, right? Don't forget to subscribe, bye. Subscribe? Yep, that's right. Don't forget to subscribe and we will see you guys next week. Bye.